A Savannah legend who spent five decades fighting for low-income families has passed away. John Finney was best known for his role as director of the Savannah Chatham County Economic Opportunity Authority. WSAV News 3's Alex Bozargian shares more on his life of service. It's going to be a chain reaction. We're going to have to solve it. John Finney never shied away from a challenge. As a 50 year director of the county's Economic Opportunity Authority, he provided much needed perspective on poverty. And we're also talking about a category of people who are, who are called a working poor. People who work every day, they just don't make enough money to make it. Finney didn't want people to just survive. He wanted them to live their best lives. He pioneered a medical clinic for sickle cell patients and even created some of the first permanent housing options for Savannah's homeless. Would it be fair to say that Savannah's forever changed by John Finney? Absolutely. Terry Tolbert met Finney when he was 16. He says the man was old school, but always thinking outside the box. John has been a first for so many things uh, and what he did he left us was the courage to try new things in spite of obstacles. And so we're always going to miss him. And I'm sure his family's going to miss him and we are going to miss him tremendously. Finney's courage gave Chatham County the first ever Martin Luther King celebration. Mayor Van Johnson says he unified Savannah and paved the way for younger generations. Well, before I talked about having people at the table, John Finney had people at the table. Um, his family's loss is also not Savannah's loss, and it's also our, our region's loss. Um, we've lost a great man. A man who always demanded the most for people who had the least. Reporting in Savannah, Alex Bozargian, WSAV News 3, on your side. Finney retired as director of the EOA in 2017. Funeral arrangements are not complete at this time.